Okay, I want to make a semi-quick video. Okay, so I'm going to boot this um, desktop to my flash drive. And um, as you can see here, Windows Boot Manager, the Patriot, that's the stock, the OEM drive that come with this desktop. And what I did was I cloned this one right here, which is the M.2 drive, Samsung SSD Evo 970 Plus. Okay, so in cloning the drive, it enabled me to, uh, basically what I wanted to do, the reason why I did it is because SSD is fast, but what's faster than SSD? M.2 drive. So like this is going to be my gaming computer slash uh, streaming rig um, that I'm going to plug my um, Legion 5 into once I start doing some more gaming and um, that sort of thing. So I'm using a boot drive called uh, Heron. Heron, I think. Um, USB. It is probably the most powerful USB that I have right now. Um, it is a very universal tool. It can be used for um, kind of reconnaissance or forensics if you wanted to. Um, you can get, um, you can bypass Windows. Um, it, well, I'm not going to get into all that stuff. But anyways, uh, it has a real powerful tool in it. I believe it's called Lazy or Loft. Uh, well, well, we'll take a look at it here in a second. So basically what I'm doing right now, I'm booting into the um, the USB drive. I have it down there. And um, this is the CLX SET version. They have different versions, and they name them by uh, Egyptian gods and, and that sort of thing. But anyways, um, this is called the SET version. Um, it's a pre-built, come with a um, NVIDIA... MSI NVIDIA 1650 graphics card. Pretty badass, actually. Pretty decent. So I'm booting now. And this is a version of Windows, so... But it's just... Here in Boot CD. PE Windows. Okay, once this gets up and running, it's going to automatically find the network because I have my Cat5, uh, my Ethernet plugged in there. It's initializing, and here it is, guys. It looks just like Windows. It's got all little little things right here. But this is what I wanted to show you. There's the the um, DHCP stuff for Network Manager. So if you go here, go to All Programs, go to Windows, All Programs, Disk Tool, or no, Recovery. Uh, I forget. Oh, Imaging, right there. Disk Tool Imaging. It's called Lazy Soft Disk Imaging, okay? There, it comes with a couple other ones, but I found this one's free. Um, I tried the first two, and it wanted me to buy a license key and all that other stuff. But anyways, um, so you boot into this, and Lazy Soft will uh, come up. It's called Recovery Suite. And it's got that little dialogue thing stuff and all that. It's okay, whatever. But anyways, um, so basically I did the, the clone right here, clone, and went through and cloned the whole thing, okay? So when I did that, now I'll, I'll go back out of here and hit restart. And once it restarts... Should come back on here in a second and then I'm gonna hit F11 to give my boot options again and then I'm gonna pick that M.2 drive see there's there it is that's the SATA drive for the Patriot that's the original OEM and then right there M.2 Samsung I'm gonna go down to that which is the, the Windows boot manager version Hit that. Now look guys, it cloned everything. I don't I shouldn't have to sign into nothing. It's all cloned, good to go. And this is an ASRock motherboard. Um Z590, if I'm not mistaken. Uh i5 processor. I might upgrade the processor in time. Haven't decided yet. 
and there it is. Cloned the exact same way I had it. There it is. Everything's on there. Everything. Everything's on there. Same thing. So that's my uh, video on cloning software. Um, the, the main purpose of doing this, guys, was pretty much like if you have a, a, a pre-built like this, and it comes with an SSD drive. There's two. There's one down there and one down there. And I have the M.2 drive in there. As you can see, when I open this up, here's my list of drives. I have, I do have Reviz, Revision OS on here too. That's on another drive. That's for, that's my, for gaming. But I got a four terabyte. Um, there's the OEM. And see, it shows up. This is the one I'm running on because that's the Windows icon right there. So this is the OEM. Oh, and now it says OEM SSD because it clones everything. OEM SSD. So it, I mean, that's what it says. And I've got a few drives on here. So uh, hope that helps you guys. Um, and I don't have this. Isn't a C and D drive. This is the original OEM right here, and this is the one that I'm using. So, if I was to go over here and do a reboot real quick, I should be able to show you that it'll boot into the other original OEM drive. Try not to make this video past 10 minutes. Spamming F11 to get in the boot, boot options. There we go. Boot options right there. And then there's the Patriot, the original hard drive. Now, I'm not downing the OEM drive, the Patriot, but, I mean, if you want ultimate performance, you, you go, to, go to SSD. That's why my Legion 5 Pro here... has two SSDs in it. I mean, that's just the way it comes. I mean, go to device manager, uh, disk drives. So you got two SSDs in there, two M.2 drives. And there we are back in Windows again. Put the pin in. And look guys, exact, exact same thing, exact, nothing different. Well, I hope this may have helped you guys. Uh, if you have any comments and questions, please let me know. Um, and that was done with here on boot on a flash on a, a flash drive, um, just a regular standard flash drive. It's my master boot one. You can go in there and redo Windows if you need to. If you're having issues, um, forget your password. It does have that strength in there. Um, if you need to redo your password, if you forget your password or whatever. Um, and this is for educational purposes only. I'm not held responsible if you decide to plug this disc in and uh, bypass someone's passwords um, or do whatever else you want to do to it. Uh, clone the whole drive like I just did. I mean, like in essence, you could clone this drive and take it out and put it in another computer uh, and, and it's whatever. But anyways, there you go. I'm at nine minutes now. Just uh, wanted to show you the power of a cloning your hard drive and being able to do it and safely and everything's there and there you go. Asian out.